Hello friends, welcome back. So in this video, I am going to explain the 3D working model of the periodic table and this is one of the most important tools in the chemistry. Basically, let us understand what is a periodic table. The periodic table is a chart that organizes all known chemical elements based on their atomic number, electron configuration and chemical properties. This periodic table was first created by Dimitri Mendeleev is now a fundamental part of studying chemistry. And this periodic table is made up of uh, using cardboard and uh, you can see we have created small colored boxes represents chemical elements and we have labeled each chemical elements with an atomic number and uh, its name there. And uh, we have given each elements in a different colors to indicate Elements are grouped like metal, non-metal, metalloid, noble gases and so on. So if we are looking in this periodic table, this periodic table is divided into two sections. One is vertical section, another one is horizontal rows. Now in the vertical columns, there are 18 groups. If you can see right, there are 18 columns we have in each group have a similar chemical properties that that is the way we are representing in this periodic table as well as uh, in the horizontal rows there are seven periods you can see each period represents a new electron shell here and uh, each of these uh, model uh, what we have done is is represented in a different color that I am going to explain which all the elements were represented in which color. If you can see right, there is a transition metals. So all the met transition metal elements we are given in this color, it is in pink color. And uh, we have grouped all the metalloid uh, chemical elements somewhere here. So these are all uh, metalloids. And uh, all the alkali metals we are given in this dark blue. So these are the all the alkali metals and we have post transition metals which we are given in light blue color and uh, we are given all the non metals here. So these are all non metals and we are given noble gases here in the dark red color here and we have alkaline earth metals so we are given in this color which is yellow color and all the lithonoid elements as well as actonoid metals so we are given in the year which we are depicted here with the 57 to 71 as well as 89 to 103 which are octonoid elements we are given in dark uh, and we have the last elements which are other metals we are given in light green here. Yeah. So this is how we are represented the complete uh, periodic table in a very simple and efficient manner. To conclude as part of this uh, periodic table, it is like a map for chemistry. It is a map of chemistry. It helps us to understand and predict the behavior of elements making this 3D model helped me to understand element grouping better and was really fun to create. Thanks for watching this video. If you found this project interesting, please like, share as well as comment your thoughts. Keep learning and see you in the next science video. Thanks for watching this video. Bye for now. Take care.